Mr. Raven? <clears throat> it's your Hollywood agent. I'm afraid you've been fired from your TV show. I'm sorry, what? Yeah, don't bother going to work. You've been replaced with a 10-year-old boy, and they're changing the name of the show to Cricket's Home. Uh, is that you again, Cricket? You need to stop prank calling me. No, no, this is certainly your agent, Nigel Wigglesmith. As I'm sure you recall, I'm British. I don't have an agent who's British named Nigel Wigglesmith. <laughs> I totally got you, Raven. It was me, Cricket, the whole time. Wow, yeah, you totally got me, Cricket. Now I need to get back to work. Wait, Raven, since I've got a big celebrity like yourself on the phone, how do I get a TV show like you? I'm thinking something like, that's so Cricket. I don't know, Cricket. Do you have anything that you're passionate about? <laughs> of course I do, Raven. Like, I'm so good at wrestling my pig Herbert. I tried to film it on my phone, but I can't figure out the camera on this thing. Okay, I'm gonna have to go. Now. Hold up, hold up. I got a serious question. What's it like having a gajillion dollars? I don't even know what that number... I've never heard of that number. Do you have a water slide that runs through the mansion, but instead of water, it's liquid gold? Now that you mention it, <laughs> I do have a water slide filled with gold. Oh my gosh, I knew it! <laughs> okay, this has been fun, but I have to go now. Wait, Raven, tell me my future. What do you see? Cricket, we've talked about this. That's my character on TV. All oh, right, right. It's just, yeah, you're such a good actress. I get confused with what's reality. Oh, that's very sweet of you, Cricket. Hey, keep me in mind if you ever need a rising star. Oh, I do a great British accent. Well, keep me in mind if you ever need a newswoman. Uh, what? Bye, Cricket! Cheerio, Raven! I'm British.